What's up, YouTube? Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are. It's Mr. Christmas signing in. Um, thank you for tuning in to my first ever vlog. We're headed to San Diego right now. Should be there about two hours, maybe. Get some food, and I'll check in with you guys. Letting the car warm up right now, so it's gonna get a fit. We got that Puma, Puma jersey. Italia, Italia, and then uh, just some regular black pants, jeans, and we got the Carmines. Let's see what we won. Hopefully she's bad. She's good luck. Medium fries. Oh fuck yeah, that's exactly what I wanted. I called it too. I called it. I'm gonna get some fries. Peace. And then we have what? Oriento. Because I'm Asian. Okay. <laughs> Alright. So this is what we end up with. This is why I'll never win the raffles for the easies. Because I never get anything big. All right, let's see what we want. So we're at McDonald's, and all this girl orders is four hash rounds. Who does that? But anyway, we have more Monopoly, so we're gonna keep playing. It's my turn now. Come on. It's hard to take it off of paper. Oh shit. Oh, Atlantic Avenue. If you guys need some pieces, let me know. You can share the millions. Connecticut Avenue. Park Place. Woohoo! Park Place. I don't know what. What's the big deal? Raining Railroad. I just got all different ones. All right, so we're eating McDonald's right now, and um, something I want to get off my chest. You know a lot of fat people. They always like to play McDonald's, but I eat McDonald's all the time. I'm not even fat. Uh, at least I don't think so. But, um, yeah, I feel like people just, you know, they want to blame something for their laziness. Because they don't want to work out or whatever. I eat out all the time, you know, and I eat out all the time. And I don't even, you know, just work it out. Just don't be lazy, all right? All right, so it turns out there were all these on the back of each hash brown there were two monopolies and that's what we end up with park place so all we need is is oh boardwalk for one million dollars so if anybody guy has this boardwalk hook it up we'll share the wealth we're not greedy I just need like 40%. And this one too. Focus. Connecticut and Oriental. All we need is Vermont Avenue and we are good. So for $1,000, if anybody want to send it my way, hit me up, I'll give you the address. And then, regular McFlurry, two medium fries, and a McGriddle. That was it, right? Yeah. I think. Yep, that was it. I promise it comes with a gift. How awesome is this narcissism? We save our hard earns to pay for these niggas of pain. Now look at me, look at me. How much pain it is. Now look at me, look at me. How much pain it is. They ain't know me, so I need more bottles, yeah Okay, these lanes gon' see that a nigga ball harder See, I got it to a T, cause my T cost dollars, yeah Still my chain so big, can't buy my color, Where the shit hold these oceans alive? 
jumping, and it's like I got a black heart. Ever since I swiped that black card, and I think that shit was ten bills. That these niggas know we in the building, yeah. And because I spent these ten bills, bitches tryin' to give me all they feelings, yeah. All around me are familiar faces, worn out places, worn out faces. Riding early for the daily races, going nowhere, going nowhere. Went to school and I was very nervous. No one knew me, no one knew me. That old teacher tell me what's my lesson. Look right through me, look right through me. Look at me, look at me. I'm about to go get wet. Hopefully we don't get wet though. On the ride for Wild Arctic. Wild Arctic. It's pouring, so we just gotta do something that's indoors. Then we get to see some animals, so hopefully it'll be fun. I'm your first officer, Norm Snowman Miller. You'll be soaring Arctic skies aboard White Thunder with Captain Emerson at the stick. When we kick the jets in on this baby, she'll do 400 miles per hour. But don't worry about safety. Our onboard computer will make sure nothing can possibly go wrong. Warning, nasty Arctic storm headed for base. I'm sure it's not that bad. No, it's bad. Then I should tell you that in the unlikely event of a water landing, the person seated next to you can be used as a flotation device. Where's <laughs> Nemo? Is that Nemo? I found Nemo. I found Nemo. Nemo. Nemo, there's two of you. Oh, there goes Dory. 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 What's up guys, so just checking in, it is about 12.30 right now, um, you know, my girlfriend and I, we decided to come to San Diego for a little vacation, just a quick one day trip, um, I'm about to go get some food right now, just going to the restroom, just waiting for her, about to go get some food, this place called Calypso Bay Smokehouse, so let you guys know what we think. Alright so we just got done eating at um, Calypso Bay, I got the sampler, it comes with the chicken, the ribs, and the sausage, it's pretty good. And now we are headed to where we go? Bayside something? Bayside <laughs> Skyride, so hopefully not too long of a line, we can make it before the Shamu show. Let's go. Got off that uh, sky ride and it's like a little cable car. So it was, it was kind of scary. Scarier than I thought it was. Oh, yes, but, it was scary. But when you get up there, it's kind of peaceful, kind of cold, but it was kind of scary. Oh, I love sharks. What? What's its name? Which one? Just be done. Okay, that one's called the white spotted bamboo shark. Or since I was really long, you can call it a bamboo shark. Yep. They're pretty amazing, right? Yeah. Why do you have a What? Why do you think that? I like the way that one 
Alright, good morning guys. So we're here at San Diego home ticket for breakfast. I apologize for last night, my camera died. We actually did go to San uh, Fashion Valley Mall, um, saw the Nike store and a couple of different spots. Um, my camera died, so I wasn't able to bring you guys along with me. Beginning a few of the people who had a problem, I was this good scoffed. I just shook off, probably reminded you of the first time you saw Tiger Woods golf. Never thought about how much my race and nationality meant, but based on how I ascended, it, see how plain it was now, they want me to jet, but no one really gave a fuck about my descent. Till I took off, took off, mistook me because I looked soft. But I stood tall, I just followed them So I rose and grew balls Told these hoes to screw off Decided opposing you was what I'm supposed to do All I did was say what I'm feeling When the vocal booth calls And had you on pins and needles When I spoke to you all You felt my pain It's almost like I poke poodle dolls And I hope my spirit haunts the studios When I'm gone My picture jumps off a poster And just holds through the halls And fucking goes through the walls Like the ghost of Lou Ross Call me set for home again And the drama said I'm going in Already got an arm and head And whoever said words to this words Ain't hurt me worth them I give a fuck at my image Even ends up taking a personal Whoever I heard or whatever bridges I burn in this bitch And whatever bitches feel like they didn't deserve what they get And whatever consequences come with every verse is worth it So die, turn to beat on whose turn is it to get murdered on it? And here's to all the years I spent towing the line over time Sure as the mold is blind in my mind I'm still underground as a groundhog and I'ma go for mine Like a whole for road is trying to dig up some gold and diamonds are cold to find I'm sliding slow when these lines on my nines I just load up the most spines And open fire with a closed mind All I needed was someone to co-sign I saw a rifle with the sniper scope for this whole time Alright guys, so just got home from a long vacation. It was definitely fun though. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. It, this was my third time being in San Diego and my second time at SeaWorld. But my first time, I didn't remember anything because I was very little. And that was actually the first time I went to San Diego. So, um, you know, this time obviously I'm older now. Um, I had a lot of fun, yeah, although it's not as big of a theme park compared to, say, Disneyland or Universal Studios, but it was still a lot of fun. Um, and obviously, San Diego was a beautiful, beautiful place. Um, if you're able to, I would definitely recommend visiting or even moving there. <laughs> um, if you're able to, like I said, it is very beautiful, obviously very expensive. Um, but yeah, guys, I hope you guys enjoy the vlog. Um, I hope to take you guys on more adventures with me. This was definitely fun to capture everything and to share it with you guys. Um, but until next time, it's Mr. Christmas, and I'm signing out. Oh, and on a side note, I'm going to talk to you. You know who you are after I say this. Go Syracuse. Syracuse is about to win everything. They're about to take the whole tournament. Just They're going to win everything. So, you know who you are, I'm talking to you, and I hope you stay tuned until the end to see this, because this message was for you.